is going on guys? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are actually going to be um, washing my girlfriend's car. Because um, she drives it. She doesn't really wash it. So I'm going to do her the little favor of like getting it nice and clean. Nice, getting, getting it looking better. Trying to get all this like leaves and stuff or whatever all that stuff is. Now this is an older car. I think it's from like a 2001. It's just a little Civic. Uh, so you can see like the paint's all coming off. This car did sit for a, uh, quite a while, so my girlfriend actually got lucky getting this car. So it runs nice, everything's good. Just the paint's coming off a little bit, like the clear. But I might have something planned for that that she doesn't know about. So as you can see, I already have all this stuff out. I'm gonna start working on the outside, so let me just get everything ready, get all the soap in the buckets, get all the grit guard in, and uh, see you in a little bit. Like when I washed my car when I showed you guys, we're going to start off with the wheels. I am actually not too worried about them because they're hubcaps. But uh, let's try and get them looking nice and better. Okay, so like when I show you washing my car and giving my tutorial, always want to start off with the wheels and the tires because they are the most dirtiest out of the car. Like you can already see that all that dirt turning yellow so I'm actually kind of curious how I don't think I've I think these tires have ever even been clean so I'm curious how oh yeah look at that it's all yellow oh, these tires are dirty they're all yellow you can't tell when they're dirty until you actually start cleaning it and you see all this yellow that's all that dirt grease and stuff that sticks onto it so rub the tires off a little bit and start cleaning the hubs. Try and get them looking a little bit nice. Gonna start working with the lugs and then get, you know, in between like these little spokes. Get them looking nice. There we go. Now I'm just gonna rinse them off, see how they look afterwards. You can already see a massive difference just rinsing these off. These do look a lot better. What I'm actually going to do is that I'm going to scrub the tire off again to try and get all the uh, all the dirt and oils off. So that way the uh, tire shine can stick a lot better. Now from just regular driving you want to make sure that all of this grease and stuff is off. So that way the tire shine can stick for a little bit longer. Wow, look at that. Okay, so I got the first one done. I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest. Okay, so we finished cleaning our four wheels and now it's time for the really fun part, just actually washing the car and actually seeing the difference. But before we do that, I'm actually gonna take the extra step and clean the windows because as you can see, when it rains, the whole windshield is just collecting all that water, all this off. The window is actually very contaminated so what I'm actually gonna do is that I'm gonna I'm gonna fix that so that way when it rains and she's driving she's not really blinded by all the stuff because as you as you've seen in the previous videos when I washed my car how all the water just beads off I'm actually gonna do that for her so that way she can feel a little bit safer driving in the rain and it's not blinding to her so I'm actually going to be uh, clay barring the windows trying to get it looking nice for her so I'm actually gonna rip just a small piece off I'm gonna take this soap bucket put this right here just get a little bit of soap on there on the clay bar like mush it up a little bit and like spread this out and then just start clay barring the window so I'm really just clay barring the window trying to get all this dirt contamination off Wow, you can actually see a lot of the dirt is coming off. As you can see, the water is starting to come off a little bit more, but I'm actually gonna start working my way around the whole car, clay barring the windows. Try and get the contamination off. Whenever you feel a rough spot, you wanna go over it again until it starts feeling smooth. Like you hear that right there. Try and get as much contamination off as possible. 
I'm trying to get this looking very nice. Okay, so we finished clay barring the windows. I am gonna clay bar the windows again, try and get like the rest of the contamination off. As you can see, it does look slightly better. The water is starting to come off a lot quicker. Now, now it's time to wash the car. side because <clears throat> if you look you see that there's a slight film that's on the inside all this stuff that's going this way is actually scratches from the wiper blades so I'm actually gonna end up going inside and then start cleaning all the windows try and get all this stuff out <sighs> Oof. it's hot so what you want to do when you clean the inside is that you're gonna want to take your hand flip it out and then basically do the backhand method try and get all this stuff off try and get all this film off flip it over buff it off all right so i went ahead and i took another uh blue microfiber towel and i'm gonna start working on the inside try and get all the all the dust off like a quick wipe or whatever all right so i'll see you when uh when basically when i'm done cleaning the inside and i'll show you the finished product finished it's been like two or three hours i spent the whole time just cleaning the inside the inside it was a uh, it's a little bit dirty it wasn't too bad but clean the inside i washed and bank it vacuum shampooed the uh the floor mats from weather tech clean the inside use a little brush got everything out the inside is looking nice i did a all-purpose cleaner cleaned this up cleaned all the cloth seats cleaned the steering wheel blew off a couple of the stuff a little bit of the dust cleaned the windows inside out the back is looking fantastic oh my god it's like a brand new car in here and then on the outside we clay barred we added a little bit of wax to try and preserve the the rest of the clear clay barred the headlight it does look a little bit better as you can see when i clay barred this one i completely forgot to clay bar this one but there is quite a significant difference this one is actually more yellow 
and the left one. They're both still yellow, but it's it's a lot better on the left side, on the driver's side. Got the wheels all cleaned up, added tire shine to make it pop. Honestly, this car went through a quite quite a transformation from this morning to here. So there it is. There's it cleaning up my girlfriend's car, getting it looking a lot better than what it actually was this morning. She doesn't drive too much. This car does sit for a little bit, so I do actually from time to time go on go inside drive it around with her try and get you know a little bit of miles on it so that way it doesn't like just sit and the battery just dies but wow this car this car looks a lot better than what it did this morning and the inside is absolutely amazing i'm honestly i'm quite impressed with myself cleaning up the inside so i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like comment subscribe don't forget to ring that notification bell if you want to hear more from me and i'll see you in the next video Peace.